In the past two videos, we had a look at data swell kit preload data and data swell kit preload code attributes that we can add on a link element or a wrapper element to preload data or code based on our requirements. In this video, I want to talk about two more attributes which are less likely to be used. That would be data swell kit reload and data swell kit no scroll. Let's understand how they work with an example. First up, data swell kit reload. We know that anchor tags are controlled by swell kit for client side navigation. If you click on products, we navigate without the page having to refresh. And this is the default behavior as well. However, for whatever might be the reason, if you need to tell SwellKit not to handle the link, but allow the browser to handle it, you can make use of the data SwellKit reload attribute. Let me add it as an attribute on the products link. Now, observe the tab fav icon, as that is the best place to see the page reloading effect. I click, and you can momentarily see the loading spinner indicating a full page navigation. Pretty straightforward usage, as you can see. The second attribute is data swell kit no scroll. When navigating to routes within the application, Swellkit mirrors the browser's default navigation behavior so that the user is at the very top left corner of a particular page. If you wish to disable that behavior, you can add a data swellkit no scroll attribute. Let's add it to the products link once again. To test this attribute though, we need some additional CSS. In the home page, uncomment the tall CSS class. And within the products folder, on the product item class, add height, and this is going to be 100 viewport height. Save the file and head to the browser. In the home page, we can see products link is way at the bottom. So we have to scroll down to it. If I now click on the link, in the next page, we are not automatically scrolled to the top of the page. We have to do that ourselves. And that is because no scroll preserves the scroll state between pages. In the home page, if I remove data swell kit no scroll though, go back to the home page, scroll down to the bottom and click on products link again you can see we are automatically scrolled to the top of the page. So reload and no scroll, two attributes that you may not necessarily need, but helps to be aware of. All right, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.